Positive and negative polarity DC voltage outputs are often needed to drive various electric circuits and components. One common example is driving op amps, like the one illustrated here, in which a positive 10 volts and negative 10 volts is needed to drive the amplifier. Some DC power supplies may already have these polarity outputs available. However, many power supplies do not have them available. You can still get positive and negative voltage outputs as long as you have at least two DC power supplies with floating outputs. Today I will show you how to set up two BNK Precision 1787B DC power supplies to get a positive and negative voltage output. I will also show you how to do the same on a BNK Precision 1673 triple output power supply. To get positive and negative voltage outputs from 1787B supplies, the setup is simple. Connect both 1787B in a series connection. So connect the positive terminal of the first supply to the negative terminal of the second supply. This series connection will be used as the reference ground. Now the positive voltage output with respect to reference will come from the second supply, while the negative voltage output with respect to reference will come from the first supply. For demonstration, I will set both supplies to output positive 10 volts and negative 10 volts. I will use a BNK Precision 2831E multimeter to verify the output voltage and polarity. Here you see negative 10 volts measured by connecting between the negative terminal of the first supply and the reference ground. Now when I connect between the positive terminal of the second supply and the reference ground to the multimeter, you will see the measured positive 10 volts output. Here is a diagram to illustrate the circuit equivalent of this setup. You can also get the same outputs using a triple output power supply such as the BNK Precision 1673. Simply connect the positive terminal of the left supply to the negative terminal of the right supply. This connection will be used as the reference ground. Then connecting the positive terminal of the left supply with respect to reference ground will output a negative voltage output. Similarly, connecting the negative terminal of the right supply with respect to reference ground will output a positive voltage output. You can also use the series tracking mode to have both channels connected in series internally. To do this, pull the voltage dial knob on the right channel. Both channels voltage display will now show the same voltage or close to. Internally, the positive terminal of the left channel is connected to the negative terminal on the right channel. Doing the same as we did earlier, you can then get negative voltage output on the left channel and positive voltage output on the right channel. 